What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Wade Concept. Today, yes, we're in the car, but this isn't a car combos episode, guys. This is something very special. We are on a mission today. We're trying to find something to, to quench my thirst. I'm a, I'm a little thirsty today, and your boy's a grown man, so sometimes I want something other than water, man. I, I don't want the Gatorade. Get the soda water out of my face today. You know why? Because we're looking for something in particular. We're looking for something that, that packs a punch. Something that you know, I can't get anywhere else. Conor McGregor has just dropped the most flavorful whiskey out of the bowels of Dublin, Ireland. I know Conor's busy going on with fight week, but he reaches out, he says, Wade, I have my fucking Irish whiskey out. It's called Proper 12. Go and get you a bottle. I said, all right, cool. So I'm gonna, what am I talking about? We're talking, of course, about Conor McGregor's Proper Irish 12 whiskey. It's just gone on sale, and with obviously the fight between the, the, the two combatants, Connor and Khabib, coming up, I want to try me some whiskey. So we're going to try that. If it doesn't punch me right in the face, then, then what are we doing here? Like this thing should have the equivalency of Connor's left hand in the first sip, and if it doesn't, I'm going to be disappointed. Connor, you're my boy, for sure. But we better have some quality whiskey. I'm just, I'm literally driving around the parking lot right now. Um, so I can tell you guys what's going on before I go get the whiskey. So, um, but yeah, we're gonna go try it. We're going to go and, and see, it's $25 a bottle. Personally, I don't go and buy a lot of whiskey um, or like handles and all the bottles and stuff. I just don't drink a lot, but I am in the bar industry. So I need to know when new things come out. And obviously it's Conor McGregor's whiskey. So I'm giving myself excuses to go out and, and try this and buy it. And uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. I mean, I've, I'm from Tennessee, so I know that, you know, I've tasted a lot of whiskey in my day. Going to college out there, Jack Daniels is a distillery in Tennessee. So we're gonna see what it tastes like. But I'm gonna park now and stop driving around the parking lot like a weirdo. And I'm gonna go get it, and I'll show you guys the bottle, and we'll take it home, and, and we'll see what happens. You know what I mean? So, stay tuned, I'm going in right now. We'll see you inside. What's going on, guys? We're back at home, as you can see. Um, didn't know you couldn't record in liquor stores. Had no idea. Bevmo wasn't happy about me bringing my camera in, so we got zero footage of actually getting the bottle, because I wanted you guys to see what I saw, my first impression of the bottle. When you guys saw it, I would see it. We'd have a, a consensual agreement between us to see the bottle at the same time. Bevmo wasn't having it. So, unfortunately, we have to do it here. But I haven't gotten a good look at it yet. So we'll, we'll, we'll do this together. Um, without further ado, Conor McGregor's Proper Irish 12 Whiskey. All right guys, now we're ready for the ultimate taste test. Um, you guys have seen the bottle, we've talked about it. Let's get down to the real nitty gritty, all right? Let's see what this is really about. Is it really gonna pack that left hand of fury on me? Is it going to fizzle out like his fight against Nate Diaz? Who knows? But we're gonna try it right now. And I'm gonna let you guys know what the true Irish whiskey tastes like. All right, how do you open this thing? Okay. <laughs> Whoo! That was no joke. I'll tell you what. Proper Irish 12 does have a chin on it. I mean, I gave it everything I had. I was hitting uppercuts, right hands, step back, jab, left cross. Didn't matter. Maybe this thing is made after Conor McGregor. It has a great chin. Now, let's just see if it's got the punch everyone talks about. Oh, by the way, if you're under 21 years old in the United States, don't consume alcohol. It's not legal. And uh, just a public service announcement, don't do it, okay? You guys, use your brains. All right? Cool. Here we go, guys. 
Not too much. <laughs> you gotta remember, I haven't, haven't had alcohol in a long time, so we're just gonna take a nice smell. So I'm getting hints of oak. A little bit of maple. A little bit of a, 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 a bourbon barrel smell. I don't know what I'm talking about. Here we go. It's actually not bad. Actually not bad. It is very, it is very um, warm in here all of a sudden. This is actually really good, guys. Not anything too, too much. Um, it's got a nice smooth taste to me anyway. Sits nice, not too smoky, not too, too hot. Okay. You know, I would consider that to be, you know, I don't know if that's a full left straight from Conor McGregor, but not bad. If we're, if we're putting up against Jameson and Jack Daniels, I'll give Conor McGregor proper riders 12, 7 out of 10, 8 out of 10. I'm definitely surprised at the quality. $26 a bottle, nothing too much. And like I said, from Tennessee, we know our whiskey. It's ingrained in our blood. So I feel like, for me, I had to get me some proper Irish 12 to appeal to my Irish heritage and my Southern heritage, all coalesced into one. That's exactly what we did today, guys. Well, your boy's drunk and <laughs> just playing. I'm not drunk. Uh, that was very tasty. Thank you guys so much for watching with me. Um, if you are over the age of 21, obviously, and you want to try it out, I think you can pick it up at your local BevMo. Um, I'm sure either some kind of wine and spirits place in your town. And if not, request it. Have them bring it in because it's new. It's not bad. Um, it's definitely something if you're a Connor fan, you can drink when he's fighting, you know, October 6th, him and Khabib. And uh, yeah, I know the press conference is going to be nutty so i'm sure he'll have this on stage with him as well so hit that like button if you guys like what we're doing here smash that subscribe button if you're new yeah we're doing different stuff now we're not just in the studio we're going to be trying to get out more and do more stuff in real life and and walk around and show you guys kind of how my life is and what i do outside of just the podcast so yeah if you like this kind of content let me know we'll do more stuff like this and if you guys are interested and again you're over the age of 21 Go pick up some proper 12. Maybe, you know, maybe it'll inspire you to go out and do something that, that you weren't necessarily wanting to do before. Or maybe it's just a nice whiskey drink for it. And if you don't drink, that's cool too. I don't really either. I just wanted to show you guys the new the new product and see what I thought about it. Um, but if you don't drink, maybe just come hang out with the Wade concept. And let's chat up about some fights. Maybe some football. It's football season. I'm a football guy, so we can talk football as well. Maybe we open up a little bit start talking MMA, football. Uh, whatever other sports are going on and you know, we just talk about other stuff in life. Whatever you guys want, man I'm here for you guys, and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so so much and you guys already know We are debating everything. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you next time We're gonna do our first official unveiling of Conor McGresker's prop Conor McGresker's Who's kind of regressors?